as video footage, relaxing footage, and some more talking from me, more hip 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 hip, again, because I was on a hiking trip on the weekend with my girlfriend and my dog, and yeah, I was definitely busier with not getting a panic attack and then filming. But I took some quite decent photos. So, to the story. We um, planned going for a hike for quite some time now. At the moment we are on this trip of trying to get healthy, trying to achieve a certain level of fitness. <coughs> and eating oatmeal and fruits and vegetables and stuff and just getting more in shape just for like health reasons. As you know, or as I once said, I suffer from a chronic migraine problematic I have had it. and just getting in shape and getting fit is a good thing to work against that problem. Another point is I suffered from several mental health issues in the past for over 20 years and not to go too much into detail I went to therapy, I still go and yeah this is also a part of maintaining like a good mental health uh, or gaining even some health there yes to the point with the hiking we don't go that much hiking it's like one two two three maybe three times a year three times if we have a really good year and my girlfriend uh, chose some mountains in the near uh, area like we live like two hours away from the Marian Alps um, I originally come from Munich and so it's not uh, far to drive to. So the mountain we wanted to hike on or to better say at the end climb on is called Teufelschnittkopf which means something like devil's side head in English. This white devil thing has gone far enough. Those mountains sometimes have weird names. Yeah. But the description was pretty fitting. Here are some images from Google um, to showcase what this mountain looks like on top. Yeah, quite, quite scary. And it's like 1800 meters high. So you walk like 900 meters in the height. So it's like a two and a half to three hours way up there and like a two hours way down. And yes, we walked like five and a half hours. The whole trip, like up and down. This was pretty far. I think it was like 10 to 11 kilometers. And I definitely didn't practice this at the beginning. Mm, yeah, and now to the scary point. I'm afraid of heights. A little bit. Not too much, but a bit, which is quite ironic because I like bouldering and climbing and stuff. 
but I don't usually have a big problem with mountains, but like there are so small paths the way up there and just and just a few hundred meters way down on each side with some pine trees and stuff like that and it was really scary but and a lot of things on that day and it was like especially in our face like I'm in right now it's like I'm going on and I have a lot of expositions like I confront myself with a lot of fears and feelings and stuff like that and things from the past and I was just like let's walk up there because my thought was if I get up there this will be a pretty good point to take awesome pictures. And I took some awesome pictures there. And it was totally worth it. Not only for the mental health or for the physical health, but also in a creative way. And I loved it. I, I really love that uh, I can achieve nice things like walking up a really scary mountain just with the goal in mind that if I do it I can take awesome pictures there. Just pushed me again some steps forward to keep this photography thing, thing going to take awesome pictures and it sometimes takes a lot of motivation a lot of energy but it's totally worth it so enough yapping yep, 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 yep. uh, of me this week you can like Comment or subscribe if you want to. Until the next video, goodbye.